We can pray one minute to the Lord right now. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray for this session. Father God, when I'm sharing this word of God, thank you, Holy Spirit, you are touching lots of people, the people, those who are watching online. I pray for each one of them. Thank you for your giving, the anointing and power to each one of them. God's power. Heavenly Father, I pray. Thank you for your doing the revival, not only in UK, not only in Europe, but in all over the nations. Especially I pray for the revival of UK and all the European, European countries. I pray for the sick people, those who are watching online. Thank you, God, when, I, when I'm sharing this word of God. Thank you for your touching the people, those who are suffering sick. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. So God bless you. Say hello. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. God bless you. Today I'm sharing uh, today's English message. Uh, supposed to join uh, print translation. Translated. We didn't, could not join today. So I'll be sharing the message today. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The starting from the second Corinthians chapter 9, verses 10. In this Bible saying, Now may he who supplies seed to the sower and bread for food, supply and multiply the seed. You have sown and increase the fruits of your righteousness. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. This is a Bible, main Bible words. I would like to explain from this Bible words. Praise the Lord. That means whatever we are sowing, whatever we are doing by our hand, praise the Lord, for Jesus Christ. According to the Bible, there is a result for that. Praise the Lord. Maybe you are giving money to somebody for gospel work. Maybe you are helping somebody. Maybe we are giving the food to the hungry. Praise the Lord. Uh, maybe sometimes you are giving the accommodation or shelter to anybody. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And helping and saying about Jesus Christ. Or sometimes in, other, uh, in another way, people are sharing the word of God and distributing the gospel right. All these ways our God is saying to you. Praise the Lord. Our God, if you are doing accordingly, our God will increase the fruits of your righteousness. Praise the Lord. And you have to give the tithes to the Lord. Praise the Lord. Every month. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So that the day, the time, and the moment when you are doing whatever, something for God. Praise the Lord. Our God is saying, our God can be able to increase everything your territories. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I would like to read one more time. Second Corinthians chapter 9, which is 10 in this Bible says, Now may he who supplies seed to the sower. Our God is a giver. Our God is given the ability and power and wisdom and knowledge to each one of you. Praise the Lord. So if we are a child of God, we have to do always the gospel work. We have to help the gospel workers. We have to help the people, those who are uh, suffering, uh, the, the, the people, those who are hungry. Praise the Lord. We have to give, give hand the people, uh, those who are mentally depressed. Praise the Lord. We have to say about gospel and say about Jesus Christ. This is our duty. If you are the children of God, this is our duty and your duty. Praise the Lord. We have to give the strength and encourage to the people those who have lost something in their life in this world. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. That's what I appreciate. Second, I would like to read one more time. Um, Sujaji, Thomas, Matthew, Claire, um, uh, Daniel, and um, Benchel. God bless you, everybody. Okay. In the second Corinthians chapter 9, verses 10, Bible says, Now may he who supplies seed to the sower and bread for food supply and multiply the seed you have sown and increase the fruits of righteousness. Praise the Lord. According to the Bible, 
if anyone those who believe in jesus christ not only in the old testament but in new testament believe in god creator creator of the world almighty god in the old testament we can say is a jahwe praise the lord and lord the new testament the lord is called jesus christ the people those who are believing in jesus christ bible say if the people those who are born again people if you are doing something for god praise the lord our god is saying our god can able to increase your finances yes praise the lord not only the financial areas our god can able to increase your church your ministry the work whatever you are doing by your hand for god everything our god can able to increase you and multiply praise the lord hallelujah the second go in the chapter 9 verses 8 in the bible saying and god is able to make all grace abound toward you that you always having all sufficiency in all things may have an abundance of every good work praise the lord hallelujah i would like to read it one more time and god is able to make all grace abound to, toward you praise the lord hallelujah that you always having all sufficiency in all things praise the lord hallelujah our god is giving the anointing and power to each and every people those who are believing in jesus christ our god is a supplier bible is saying our god is a good shepherd we are we all are the sheep our god is a, a good uh, our god can able to guide you our god can able to give the protection to the people those who are believing in jesus christ no matter the situation whatever you are facing today praise the lord if the day the time the moment when you ask the help from jesus christ jesus christ is ready to come and give his hand to all the people praise that's what bible is saying book of isaiah chapter 41 verse 10 to 13 bible says fear not i am with you praise the lord hallelujah i will give my righteous right hand to you i will help you i am saying fear not i will help you this is what our god is saying book of isaiah chapter 41 so that all the people are watching you mind praise the lord sometimes you will think oh god i am alone what will i do i don't have money to pay the rent i don't have money to put my petrol i don't have money to travel i don't have money to you know that one print the tracts i don't have money to pay the church rent i don't have money you know that one lots of lots of things lots of lots of questions your mind from your mind it will come to you but you have to say one answer to all the, um, the, the, the you have to answer you have to reply to your mind what you have to reply bible saying and god is able to make all grace and abound to it our god is a giver our god is a good supplier our god can make you you know that one, our god can get everything whatever i need our god can um, and, um, uh, make everything perfect in my life this is the way we have to respond to your mind praise the lord hallelujah your mind and our mind every each and every day it will say your mind will say we cannot do anything praise the lord but we have to say according to the bible our god can able to provide praise the lord you know that in 2017 i started to preach this gospel the public ministry from that time onwards praise the lord i was praying to the lord only one thing father god i should not ask i should not beg in front of everybody because of for your gospel praise the lord from that time until now our god is helping me protecting me even if my brothers you know they don't all devil devil was doing in all the areas of my life praise the lord devil was trying to destroy my life in all the areas financial areas and in all the areas all the surrounding areas praise my spiritual life and everything praise the lord but one thing i want to say one thing to all the people our god is a good supplier our god will never leave you nor forsake you when i was facing lots of troubles in my life praise the lord the financial troubles the lots of troubles all the people those who standing sorority place of me they were thinking oh i will never get grow praise the lord i will never get to increase praise the lord but oh my god he was helping me to stand perfect in front of everybody so today i want to say one thing to all the people praise the lord put your trust in god put your trust in jesus christ jesus christ can able to help you jesus christ can able to guide you jesus christ can able to direct you whatever you have to do 
what are you what you should not do what you should do everything our god can able to teach you praise the lord hallelujah according to the bible i want to say accordingly you know that one many times when i was preaching the gospel in the street lots of people came and disturbed me sometimes they put the foot in front of me towards my body and mouth and everything praise the lord hallelujah and beaten by the people when i was preaching the gospel praise the lord but no the the people they you know devil could not separate me from the love of god praise the lord the persecution happened praise the lord rejection happened you know all the prices even if the social media too praise the lord lots of things happened but in between our god gave me the power and anointing me to preach this gospel in front of everybody our god is a good god praise the lord hallelujah so the people those who are watching online never give up praise the lord hallelujah your hope in god bible is saying praise the lord hallelujah so second god in chapter 9 verse 9 bible says it is written he has uh, does first abroad he has given to the poor his righteousness and us for our praise lord hallelujah that means according to the bible if you are the child of god we have to help the others praise lord but we cannot help everybody in the social media in all the places maybe the whatsapp i am getting lots of phone calls lots of text messages message this church need help that church need help a lots of help they need but we can't help everybody praise lord but we can able to help one person praise the lord some people are suffering sickness they are asking the help or sometimes these kind of people will not respond as if we are not helping but we don't want to look after anybody praise the lord we can able to, if we can able to help one person that is a greatest thing in front of the lord as a human being as a person we cannot able to help everybody but at least one person we can help praise the lord hallelujah when you are preaching gospel or when you are going to street we can see lots of homeless people we cannot help all the homeless people but at least one homeless person we can buy one kfc or some food or sandwich or anything we can give to him praise the lord hallelujah that is what if you are doing accordingly our god is saying in your famine time our god will remember you you know that one abraham he gave the very good hospitality to the lord three angels praise the lord hallelujah two angels and one is god praise the lord hallelujah very good hospitality nice food gave to that three angels but years and years later after 400 years later you know that one all the children of israel our god is help all the children of israel to come out from the land of egypt to the promised land 40 years our god was feeding all the children of israel and our god has handed over all the promises what our god has given said to the abraham the promises uh, our god has given to all the children of israel praise the lord that is a uh, promised land of canaan so today i want to say this god is a promise keeper no matter our situations no matter what is our circumstances if our god said something from his mouth this god can able to keep you this god can able to deliver you his promises by the lord this god can able to fulfill his promises in you this is what i want to say to people praise the lord hallelujah so that's the second god in chapter 9 which are 10 in this bible says now may he who supply his seed to the sword i would like to read one more time that one uh, and bread for food supply and multiply the seed you have sown and increase the fruits of your righteousness praise the lord hallelujah so i would like to say my testimony a little bit <laughs> as i said 2013 i born again and baptized praise the lord always <laughs> i will say baptism according because baptism is very important one my life the so back home also the lots of people they were watching my videos the last time somebody called me they need baptism baptism marriage because i don't have church in india praise the lord so um, by the grace of god um, connected to the another church that people are getting the baptism soon praise the lord so i want to say all the people we have this a commandment of the lord if our god want to bless you if our god want to remember you what you have to do it we have to first of all we have to born again and we have to take the full water baptism praise the lord we have to trust in god we have to come back to the lord we have to believe in the lord we have to believe the power of the lord praise the lord hallelujah if you believe accordingly 
you what all the thoughts which is we what or it is sometimes we are getting any of the thoughts or anything personal disappointment from your mind or heart or anything what or it is happening in your life praise the lord if you are trusting god you can able to defeat all the things all the satanic thoughts and everything what or it is coming from your mind praise the lord by the glory by the mighty power of the holy spirit this is what our god is saying worship our lord make time spend time with god if you are um, if you can able to spend time with god praise the lord our god can able to give his anointing and present to you praise that's what apostle paul said the christ is in you the hope of glory the glory is god is sitting in your heart so each and every people the people those who are watching from uk and europe and africa north and south america and asian countries only one thing if you are praying to the lord every day if you are spending time with the god every day you are like devil cannot destroy your life because our god is your shepherd our my god is my shepherd praise the lord hallelujah bible says because some chapter 91 bible saying your your side or right side thousands or 10000 they will fall and they will get die by again bible is saying this will never come near to you because bible is saying you are in jesus christ you are trusted god you are believing in jesus christ because of this reason bible is saying i will send my heavenly angels to get the protection for you praise the lord we are the only one people and protected people living in this world that is all the children of god children of israel praise the lord hallelujah that's the second bible is saying uh, book of ephesians chapter 2 bible is saying we all are the family members of the lord we are sitting in the families of the lord if we are sitting in the families of the lord there is a father in the family praise the lord hallelujah our father in the family that means our spiritual father is a god almighty praise the lord we all are his child his children our god will look after his child praise the lord his sheep we are the sheep of the lord praise the lord so because of this reason what all the things you are thinking or oh, something has happened in your life accidentally accidentally death happened in your in your family or anything everything our god knows very well praise the lord hallelujah only one thing what all the things even if what are you thinking right now everything our god knows very well before you think praise the lord hallelujah so our god knows very well what is it is going whatever it is going on in your mind in your heart and everything praise the lord because our god is a creator our god knows very well very well uh, our god can come to know everything very well what is going on in your heart praise the lord hallelujah so the people those who are suffering the sickness sometimes you are thinking oh medical science cannot heal my body or my sickness but bible is saying bible is saying trust in god again bible is saying how you can trust in god look at read the bible book of acts how many times our god all the disciples of jesus christ has healed the sick people and gave the light the people from the death to the life praise the lord hallelujah when you read the bible book of acts on the gospel john Uh, how many um, uh, number of healings jesus christ has done jesus christ has healed the paralyzed person jesus christ has healed uh, the blind people right two blind people and 10 blind people praise the lord hallelujah jesus christ was healed uh, the lepers jesus christ was healed praise the lord a woman she was having 12 years of blood uh, lots of informatis people though when they were hearing the gospel from jesus christ jesus christ was healed lots of multitude lots of people praise the lord hallelujah our god's nature is a healing nature our god's nature is a miracle nature our god's nature is a mercy merciful god praise the lord the another nature of god is a he is a loving kindness praise the lord so because i want to say to one thing to all the people if you are asking if you are asking the help from god praise the lord definitely our god can able to help you praise the lord that's what bible is saying nothing shall be impossible with god with the god everything is possible praise the lord maybe you don't have visa maybe you don't have anything the how many, how many times you are thinking you are spending your time oh what will i do to get my visa what will i do to get my stamp my you know that one the passport and everything praise the lord hallelujah you know that one devils devils always following and destroying your life because devil knows very well your assignment the country where you are standing praise the lord devil knows very well praise the lord you are anointed person they will want to destroy your life they will want to push you out kick you out where you are living right all that country but bible is saying you are my beloved one 
I will never leave you in a forsake you. I will make a way for you. Praise the Lord. I have opened the door for you. Yeah, that door nobody can shut it. Again, Bible says, I will go before you. I break all the bars of irons. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. That means you, you will never get any other problems. Praise the Lord. Wherever your oh, doors are crossed, our God is saying, I will be opening another door for you. Another door for you. Another door for you. Another door for you. Wherever, whatever you need. Our God can able to supply all your needs. Praise the Lord. This is what our God is saying to each and every people today. Never think more. Praise the Lord. Your mind always, you know, that one, give you negative thoughts and everything. Say the Bible words. Repeat the Bible words. Say the Bible words from your mouth. Okay. And receive the life in your body, in your mind, in your heart. Praise the Lord. This is what our God is asking from you today. Praise the Lord. Ask to the Lord. Praise the Lord. Get something and give thanks and praise to the Lord. And give to somebody. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Introduce Jesus Christ to everybody. Whatever you can. Today, one person asked me, Praise the Lord, go to this place. There is a great anointing going. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I got a message. I'm not saying who is that one. Praise the Lord. One of the places, the greatest, you know, the worship and harvest is going on. That's fine. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I was asking one thing to that person. The place where you're living. Praise the Lord. How many number of people came to know Jesus Christ is their Lord and Savior through you? Through you, how many number of people got salvation? I was asking to him. He didn't reply. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Revival is happening in lots of places. In UK, revival already happened. Praise the Lord. In the different places, different cities of the world, revival, it has already been happened. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. We all are in the part of the revival. We all are in the revival right now. Praise the Lord. No need to go. Oh, revival is there. No, so that you don't want to go and, and participate in the revival. Praise the Lord. Revival is in you. Revival is there in your heart. Wherever you're touching your feet, that place our God has given for you for the revival. Praise the Lord. How revival is happening? When you when the time is the moment, when you raise your hand and worshiping our Lord, when you're declaring the goodness and mercy of the Lord in front of everybody, when you're introducing to somebody the Gentiles, Jesus Christ is a living God. Praise the Lord. That time, you know, that one, we are by default, directly and indirectly, we are sharing the mighty power of the Holy Spirit the Holy Spirit power to each and every people. That means the Holy Spirit will touch each and every people and get them ready for the revival. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. This world is already st already uh, standing in front of the revival, all the nations. So that what you have to do it in your house, we have to start the revival. In your house, we have to give the thanks and praise to the Lord. In your house, we have to worship our Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. We shall doing accordingly. Our God can be able to help you. Our God can be able to multiply you. Our God can be able to support you. Wherever you are going, this God will never leave you in over save you. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Our God is a mighty Lord. Praise the Lord. So today, that's your book of Philippians chapter 4, verses 19. In this Bible says, And my God shall supply all your need according to his riches in glory by Christ Jesus. Praise Our God can be able to supply everything, whatever you need. Sometimes if you are thinking, praise the Lord, you want to supposed to give, you want to give the rent today, praise the Lord. Sometimes our God, sometimes our God cannot, you know, they don't um, come and give directly the money to you. Our God can get the wisdom and knowledge to you. Our God can, you know, that one, uh, you know, make your hand perfect to do, to get something in your life. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Our God can be able to help you in your, your business. Our God can be able to help you the work which you're doing. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Physically or spiritually. Our God can be able to help you. Our God can be able to help somebody to help you get the help in your life. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Because our God is a good God. So the people, those who are watching online, give to somebody. Nothing to worry anything about your life. Always give the thanks and praise to the Lord. One day miracle will happen. <laughs> our God is a miracle Lord. Praise the Lord. They will always will give the tensions and disappointment and anxiety in your mind. Praise the Lord. But we have to say, my God is a good God. Through my God. I will I will see the victory. Right? That's what the Bible is saying. First John chapter 5, Bible says, with Jesus Christ, the people, those are believing in Jesus Christ. We are a more than a conqueror in Christ Jesus. We cannot be a failure because Jesus Christ is my God. Praise God. Hallelujah. Jesus Christ has suffered at the cross for you and me only for one reason. You had to, you had to be a, a you know, the, the, you had to be a rich person in this world. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So that all the people those are watching online. Our God can be able to supply everything, whatever you need in your life. That's what the Bible says in the Malayalam. 
നിങ്ങളുടെ ബുദ്ധിമുട്ടൊക്കെയും മഹത്വത്തോടെ തന്റെ ധനത്തിനൊത്ത വണ്ണം ക്രിസ്തു വേശുവിൽ പൂർണ്ണമായി പ്രൈസലോട്ട് തീർത്തു തരും പ്രൈസലോട്ട് So that Baptist book of Isaiah chapter 58 verses 7 Baptist says, Is it not to share your bread with the hungry and that you bring to your house the poor who are cast out? When you see the naked that you cover him and not hide yourself from your own flesh. Praise the Lord. If you are doing accordingly, the Bible is saying if you are doing accordingly, praise the Lord. But my, that means whatever you are doing for the sake of jesus christ to the society to the people our god is giving the high reward for you praise the lord book of isaiah chapter 58 verses 8 bible says then your light shall break praise the lord for like the morning your healing shall spring for speedily praise the lord and your righteousness shall go before you and glory of the lord shall be your rear guard praise the lord hallelujah so that the people in short if you are the child of god praise the lord do the good things to everybody praise the lord never say anything against anybody never criticize anybody praise the lord hallelujah sometimes if you are doing any of the fault from my from our side before you go to bed we have to ask that to repent your sins ask sorry to the lord praise the lord hallelujah if you are doing accordingly our god can able to help you in your due time in your famine time this god can able to help you this god can able to get the best of you praise the lord so most some of the people are getting the failure you are thinking oh i cannot do anything i will sit my house not like that praise the lord hallelujah again you have to try once you are getting the failure again you have to try again you have to try again you have to try the victory will be yours praise the lord hallelujah let us pray one minute heavenly father in the name of jesus christ i pray for all the people right now especially the people those who are watching online father god i pray for them this is a wonderful word of god you shared in front of everybody father god i pray thank you for your keeping each and every people in your glory spiritually all the areas father god i bless each one of them as we can pray for i pray to the people those are watching online father god i pray for brother thomas i pray for dom and alfred soman praise the lord hallelujah shivakuma lots of people are watching online praise the lord hallelujah family patrick praise the suja praise the lord hallelujah the people those are watching online father god i pray for them i pray for the people those who sent the message uh, pray, pray for their family for their father and mother and family members father god i spring the blood of jesus catch you on them right now heavenly father god i pray right now i spring the blood of jesus catch you on them right now heavenly father I, i pray i declare the healing and deliverance right now father in jesus name shakala turakan shantata patakal father god i pray i pray for everybody those who are supporting Shake the national ministry. I pray for all the people, those who are supported by seed and prayer. Father God, I pray for them. Once again more, I pray in Jesus' name. Amen. So God bless you. May our God bless you and keep you in your glory. Thank you.